Hi, this is Justice with LearnBuildBox.com. We're going to be going through one-way collisions and uh, explaining what that is, and then also uh, element grouping. Now, this is more of a hack on the grouping, but the one-way collisions is an official release on version 1.1 of BuildBox. So uh, I'm going to show you here. I've got a block. This is not a straight 2D perspective, but you'll get the idea just fine. All right, so I'm going to click on the object here, and we're going to go Collision Shapes. And I have this set with the arrow pointing here. And I'm going to deselect this, reselect it so you can see how to do this. Grab the little circle. It's going to spread open the 360 uh, wheel that lets you go. Now this arrow is going to point to where it's going to hit the character. So this little circle, uh, I believe, represents the character. So that means they're hitting against this point, And that's where the stop is. All right, now I've also done that with these right here for a different direction. By default, this comes with the arrow pointing up. Now I made this platform real narrow here so that it can pass through uh, fairly easily. And that really doesn't make too much of a difference, but uh, for preference, I like it that way. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how this looks. I'm gonna maximize this. All right, so character can pass through here and when he walks back he hits against the wall now you see he's jumping up through these I'll enable a power up here and you'll see he jump up this is part of the new infinite levels where you can go up as far as you want and sideways as far as you want and I'll show you how I group that set of stars now one thing you want to be aware of is when you fall, I ignore it. it says I win. I have that set up as a hack for something different here. All right, so that shows you how to use the one-way platforms. I'm going to show you how to do real quick, easy grouping. Now, I want to move this whole thing. This is a bunch of different objects, the same object repeated, obviously, many times uh, with different sizes and positions. So if I hit Alt, it brings up, obviously, your connection mode and you just drag from one to the next. If I want to move this whole platform, this whole thing is connected because I use the connection one. If I want to do the same thing here, let's say I like this platform and wanted to copy it, I'm going to hit Control C, Control V, and now when I move, okay, apparently I only got those two. Uh, when I move this and copy it, it's going to copy the entire group as well which is useful and you can go right back in and uh, disconnect some of this stuff. All right, I hope that was useful. Uh, send uh, any requests for new tutorials to me at uh, learnbuildbox at gmail.com or post a comment on this page, on this video, and I will be happy to get back to you and hopefully make a video quickly.